hi guys welcome to Wix ideas in this video i'm going to show you how to add the marquee text or scrolling text into your Wix studio websites now this is a new element that Wix has added into the Wix studio platform and as you can see this is a very beautiful and conversion friendly feature that you can add to your Wix store or your Wix studio website now as you can see over here you can customize what text is shown what separator you can use and also when you hover on it it can also be paused now most importantly you can add a link so that when you click on it it takes you to a page on your website or scrolls you to a section of your website or even to an external website so i'm going to share with you the step-by-step -step method that you can use to add this amazing feature into your wix studio website and before we start this tutorial i'm walter and if you haven't already done so please don't forget to subscribe to my channel this is going to be a big help to my channel and it's also going to get these videos across to all wixers across the world looking to add amazing features like this into their Wix website. Now, without wasting any more of your time, let's get started. All right, so this is the page where I'm going to be working on, and right, just right about this section, I'm going to add a new section just at the top, and this is the section where I'm going to add the text or the scrolling text to. So head over to the plus sign over here, which is Add Elements. Go all the way to Texts, and over here you can see that there's a new tab called the Text Mark, and here you're going to add a marquee text to your Wix Studio website. So drag and drop any of these examples or any of these samples that you want. So I'm going to go with the very first option, and what I'm going to do is to snap this to the very top of this section. And I'm going to go ahead and stretch this across my page. Now, what you can do here is that you can change what this label says. So go ahead and change what the label or the text says. So I'm going to say that free shipping on two or more others. All right. So as you can see, it says free shipping on two or more others. So this is a way you can actually let your users know that there is a benefit to your website and you want them to actually order more. So this is a great conversion rate optimization element. All right. So once you're done, you can head over to the link here and you can link to a page on your website so because of our time i'm not going to be going through many of these i'm just going to link this to a store page which is going to be a product page and i'm going to link it to a particular product here all right so once you're done click on your section as you can see the section is a bit too tall for our market text you're going to head over to this section where you're going to toggle off the apply max width and over here if you go to advanced you can see we have a max width and this is just forcing it to apply with the max width so we're going to toggle that off which will set the max width to none and most importantly you're going to head all the way down to the advanced css grid and this is where you change you know the height of this element to fit perfectly with your marquee text so head over to the row and we're going to set the row which is you know this direction the horizontal level we're going to set that to max content now once you do that you can see that the height of the section is now fitting perfectly with the height of our marquee text so next we're going to click on our marquee text and this is where we design our marquee text so over here you're going to go ahead and choose the design that you're comfortable with this could be the brand of your website and as you can see this text is a little bit too large and the users can't really see all the text all at once so what i want to do is to choose the fonts that they can see all the text all at once so let's just go with 70 and as you can see it says free shipping on two or more orders and we can go further and just bring that to 50 and that is looking perfect now the next thing you can do here is to change the color of your text so you can choose the brand that you're working with or the brand of your website i'm going to go with that color and you can also choose to add some styles to it like make it bold you can make it italic or you can even underline your text i'm not going to underline my text I'm just going to leave it at bold and italic and you can do more things like highlight it and also you can change the, the direction of the paragraph and over here is the capitalization which we have non-capitalization here and you can choose to add the uppercase or lowercase but since I already added my capitalization directly from here which is defined with uppercase none of this is going to work so we can just stick with none and you can go for that to add some spacing to your text so you can add character spacing or item spacing you can change the tag that it is if it's a paragraph and so on but what we're interested in are these two options right here which are the separator and the movement so let's expand the separator so let's go ahead and click on this plus sign here and as you can see this is 
where you choose the element that separates your text so let's choose a very cool element i'm going to go ahead and choose this hollow circle here and once you do that you can see it adds a separator between your text and here you can also change the color of your shape so we can choose a bright color so that it stands out so let's go ahead and choose this green for now and over here you can choose the size of your shape so you can make it smaller or just leave it as it was or you can change it to 100 percent so that it fits perfectly with the size or the height of your marquee text now let's move on to the movement and here is where you determine the speed of your marquee text so the more you move to the right the faster it goes and the more you move to the left the slower it becomes so i'm going to go ahead and just push this all the way to around 20 and here is the direction that you want your marquee text to go in so this is going to go from right to left and you can also decide to change it to go from left to right so you can change that and choose what direction that you like more and most importantly you can decide to pause this on hover so that your users can read the marquee text when they pause it and especially if it's moving too fast for them to read now we have concluded with the features that we need to add with customization and what this feature is all about let's go ahead and publish and see how this looks like on a live site all right so if we scroll all the way down you can see that we have our marquee text the way we have designed it on the back end as you can see the color that we have decided and also the shape divider that divides the text at each point or each breakpoint and most importantly you can see that the speed is a bit too fast but it's not too fast a user cannot read and that's why we've added a hover and pause so the user can pause this and read what you have written on your marquee text now this is how you add a marquee text to your wix studio website and if you have enjoyed this tutorial please don't forget to smash the subscribe button and give this video a like thank you very much and i will see you in the next video